What happens when you take a company that makes stuff for a game you absolutely love that's in the community and makes a game of their own? <laughs> Hey dudes, John here, and welcome to a review of a brand new game coming up next year sometime, I'm assuming. It's called Hytale. This looks freaking exciting. It's made by a company called Hypixel. If you guys are in the Minecraft community, I'm sure you darn well know who they are. And uh, they made their own game. Microsoft, you need to step your stuff up, man. These guys, oh my lord. I saw a glimpse of this already. Uh, this morning uh, when Ethan and Liam were watching uh, the trailer of it, I'm like, oh, I got to do a video on this because this looks freaking amazing. Let's go ahead and take a look here uh, at the first look trailer of this brand new game. I'm so excited. I can't wait for this. Look at the oh, animals chasing each other. Tell me that happens in the game. The build style looks very Minecraft-esque. Oh, the chicken. The dog closes his eyes! Mining looks like mining. Woodworking looks like making tools. Oh my god, all of it. This looks so amazing. Wait, 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 wait. So I build... If you guys know anything about my gameplay videos, I love building in deserts for one reason and one reason alone. I would love to build anywhere else, quite honestly. Because the desert, for the most part, is pretty boring and bland. you got to bring trees in. you got to bring all the stuff with you. The rain. The rain is... Oh, I hope they have a toggle off for the rain. I really do. Because they hate the rain. They hate the weather. It's like one of my biggest pet peeves. And no game needs rain. It just doesn't. I don't care how dramatic you want to make it look. It just. I, I hope they make it turn off. Anyway. I digress. There's deer. There. What was that? Hold on. There's deer. Deer. Oh, the moon. Oh, look at everything. It looks fantastic. So this looks like like you almost have like a shaders with some unworldly, some other planetary stuff going on here. It looks amazing. The graphics look fantastic. And this is my, my biggest gripe about Minecraft is that in order to make Minecraft fantastic, like amazing, you really need to dump a bunch of mods into it. Not that I don't love vanilla Minecraft. I love vanilla Minecraft, but there's only so far you can get. Uh, you can get creative, you can build a million things, unlimited items, but this looks like they took World of Warcraft and smashed it with Minecraft. Let's let's continue on. Look at this. Oh, what is that? That little dude. That's what I was talking about. Oh, look at it, like a mesa biome. Like it's almost like a mix between a savanna and a mesa biome together with a little cactus, like skewed everywhere, and rocks are actually placed in random locations, not just up a single block i'm so excited birds why minecraft doesn't have birds other than chickens or ducks or quacks i don't know what the crap they are honestly i don't know but this is awesome you have a walking stick you have a bone arrow and then you get look at this like these crazy bee creatures this almost reminds me of that scene from star wars is it episode three i think it is when they're in that that big old hive looking thing and they're, they're trying to get out, and there's all these creatures. That's what it reminds me, very Star Wars-esque. But there's things you have to fight. Evil-looking bugs. Uh, what are these? They, they look like Endermites. It looks like whenever you're entering a dungeon that there are things to be feared, not just the random zombie or skeleton. Like, there is actual danger, so you have to, 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 to like jump in knowing darn well that you may die. <coughs> Yes. Look, they react when you hit them. They don't just bounce back and, and, and keep coming at you like they're unhurt and make a single sound. He actually ducked down when you hit him. And he's coming for you, too. He's coming fast. And then the rain. Make the rain go away. Look at that. And then you build your village. And it, oh. Did that show a hot air balloon? Do things fly? Right here. Watch. Yes. Oh, see, that's another thing that I, I love about modded Minecraft is things like Tinker's Construct. And if you guys have watched my previous videos, you know how much I, I absolutely love Tinker's Construct is you can build really, really OP weapons. But some of the things to make those OP weapons are really hard to find. And I'm hoping that's the case here because this looks like some kind of fire sword. And that looks like a freaking snow monster. Got to use the proper weapon for the proper creature. Right. That makes sense. 
Because, and he's riding a freaking ram. The rams have horns. Look at that. He's going to pick up the earth. He's like a freaking epic enderman. He picks up a giant chunk of earth. And he throws it at you, of course. That's awesome. Because there are going to be little campfires. And the boats look like boats. They don't just look like a brick. Look, again, I'm not knocking Minecraft. I love Minecraft. I love Minecraft every single day. I play Minecraft every single day. Absolutely love the game. But if something like this were to stand up to the way it looks so far, and it actually comes through the way it looks so far, it, it's it's going to be really tough. I hope they have redstone. You see what I'm seeing here? So you don't just go underwater and you hold your breath or you get aquafinity or, or whatever it is, a conduit to, to get you infinite breathing. He has a scuba tank. He has fins. And the ocean is the best aquatic update I've ever freaking seen. This is what the aquatic update should. Look at this. This is like flat out Subnautica. I, I love Subnautica too. That's like one of, the, one of my favorite open world games it's a fantastic game. This is freaking amazing. There's eels. The fish look amazing. Ooh, what are those? What are the are so are those just torches or are these like rock monsters that you have to like look out for? Because this looks like emeralds. That looks like like redstone. No, no, they're bats. They're bats. I see them now. You can kind of see the outline of them. This one's flying. This one's upside down over here. And there's two more over there. And there's one here and one. Oh, cool. And there's dungeons. So we, we already have like strongholds that are underground that you can go after and whatnot. But can you imagine having like doorways and stuff that makes it feel very grand? Anyway, this looks freaking really, really cool. And of course, there's like crazy amounts of creatures coming after you. I wonder if like all dungeons are truly dungeons. Like sometimes you'll walk into a stronghold and you won't see any mobs. And you'll, you'll see like one around a corner. You might have to go shoot a skeletons, or you might have to go kill a creeper that comes at you. But this has got like full on boss battles. And that you only get in mods. You don't get that in vanilla nothing. You have what? The wither, uh, the, the wither boss. You have the ender dragon. You have a gar guardian, elder guardian, and a phantom, I guess, now. And that's about it. I mean, I'm sure I'm missing one, but you get my drift. There's not much that you really have to go after in order to, uh, to, to proceed. And you don't even have to fight those to play Minecraft. I guess if you want to finish, you got to kill uh, both an ender. Do you have to kill a wither boss? No. No, you don't. Huh. Ah, look at these. Oh, my Lord. Look at the moon. It's like blood red. And you're in some kind of hellish terrain. And these crazy fire monsters. You see there, that fire sword that he was holding against that ice monster leads me to believe that it may not work against these guys. And you may need some kind of like ice sword or a water sword or just some kind of crazy contraption that's going to kill these crazy rock monsters. These rock monsters uh, reminds me a lot of uh, Skylanders, actually. A lot of the creatures in here look a lot like Skyline. And a little bit like Creativerse, actually. There. Here we go. Look at the spider. Oh, ho, ho, ho. The sword is so big. He's just dragging it behind him, and it's just causing chaos on the floor. Dead Skelebones up there. I don't know what that is. Some skele Oh, they, that's right. The Skelebones rise up out of the ground. That looks like what they're, what they're going to do right here. So when you walk up to them, they rise up out of the ground. Boom. Oh, there's like enchantments. There's like a mace. There are wands. Treasure. Oh, man. Look at that. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. And that's what you get when you get somebody like Hypixel making a game. You get this. This is a community server. They know servers. They know the community like really freaking well. And I wonder if that's how they're going to monetize this game. I wonder if there'll be a small fee to purchase it. And the rest of it will be uh, monetized through the server, the community server, playing games online, um, getting higher ranks and whatnot, making it truly like an MMO. I don't know. That could be really freaking cool because I don't see this game being expensive. I really don't. I see it being an under the $20 mark, $19.99 or even $9.99 or even free. 
and then they monetize it through their servers. This is going to be awesome. It's going to be amazing. Look at this. The skins. The sheer amount of skins you can have. Like, they, they seem like you can download a ton. Or maybe you can make your own. Yeah, oh. Is this Bed Wars? Or is this Sky Island? Oh. Oh. Hunger Games. Yeah, they're going to... <laughs> It's going to be hard to compete with this. Oh my. If this pans out the way I think it's going to, this is going to be a game changer for, for Minecraft, which is tough to say because Minecraft has been a number one selling game to still to this very day. It's still a number one selling game uh, in, in the world. Or this is going to be our Minecraft 2.0. We'll see. Did that have guns? They're, they're lasers. They're shooting freaking lasers play you can create your own things you make your own skin that's the way it should be so they're not going to make money off of the skin make unless you can unlock things that's quite a possibility you can unlock different things and then uh you can build your skin the way you want to which would make sense actually if they did the unlock thing years ago before Minecraft was sold to uh, Microsoft, this was available in Minecraft. See this? See this audience? You can only watch with a few people. It wasn't this huge audience of people. Um, you can download a uh, Netflix something and actually view it or a YouTube something and actually view it. Now you need a mod in order to do that. And you can only go up to, I think, 10.2. I don't know if it works on 12.2 yet. But you can only do it up to 10.2 and you can do a video on a video screen. But that's, again, it needs a mod to do it. You can't do it with vanilla and you definitely can't do it on the console. So, yes, please. This is fantastic. You can actually do like a viewing party of something. You can actually invite your friends into a server or if it's in the Hypixel server itself, you go into a theater and you can watch a viewing party of somebody else's video. There's so many possibilities. Advertisements, freaking your videos. If they're advertising specific YouTubers or, or content creators and have videos running inside the theaters or different videos running in different theaters. Oh, man. This could be really freaking good. World edit. Like, my, just world edit. Just boom. Yeah. Uh, movie making. It looks like cameras. Um, and you can, oh, there's coding, there's uh, spells, dragons, dragons, because why not dragons? Epic. This is fantastic. I'm so excited for this. I can't wait. Uh, oh, and I, I need to say, um, we're too small of a YouTuber to be sponsored by any, any one game. Sure. We get free games from time to time. Um, but we're not sponsored by Hypixel in any which way, shape, or form. I've never contacted them other than at Minecon. Uh, we spoke to them for a little while. That was a few years ago, 2016. So I haven't spoken to anybody from Hypixel about this particular game. Not an ad. I just genuinely love the way this looks. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you guys enjoy this review. And um, I think this is going to be truly exciting. Uh, the, the next thing that we're going to see uh, possibly blow up. It may, may not. I could be wrong. I've been known to be wrong. So who knows? Uh, like I said before, guys, if you guys do like this video, if you guys want to see more about Hypixel as more news comes out, let me know in the comment section below or by simply smashing that like button as well. If you're at all new to this channel, you guys can click that subscribe button. It does help the channel out a great deal. And while you're at it, if you click the little bell, it does turn on notifications and it lets you guys know when we upload our videos. And until next time, guys, see ya. Yeah.